Good morning, everybody. Dylan Spangenberg, Fitness TV here, and today we're making protein waffles. Hey guys, so the first ingredient we'll be utilizing today is gonna be some first form vanilla protein. We're making a couple of waffles today, so we want two scoops of that. All right, the second ingredient is going to be some almond milk. I go with the unsweetened uh, vanilla flavor, so we don't got much left, but we put in what we got, you know. Throw that, throw that stuff in there. Next ingredient is going to be some of your egg whites. It's got a little bit more protein, about five grams per serving. Servings, about three tablespoons. So we're just gonna, I'm just gonna dump some of that in there. That's gonna give them that nice uh, puffy texture that you want your waffles to be. Now this next ingredient here, it's actually the secret ingredient. It's gonna be your PB Fit powdered peanut butter. This is this is where people make the mistake. Right here. So you're just gonna dump some of that in there. Just a you know a casual amount. Ultimately, this is just gonna get you some more protein. And then this. You know, a lot of people say you need baking powder. I couldn't find it at the store. So, we just got baking soda. And you don't really need it. You just wanna make sure there's a little bit in there. So what I like to do, I like to just, I give a little slap here. Just till a little bit comes out. That's all you need, you just need a little tiny bit. Boom. And the final ingredient is gonna be a good old fashioned egg. And do, boom. Hit that on the side there. You know, you gotta not let that egg show. That's definitely gonna go in there, go in there. Got egg shell, I can see it. Look at that, it's trying to trick me. Trying to trick me. There it is, we got it. Throw that in there. Let's see if this one goes a little better here. Just throw two eggs in there, just for taste. You don't want to put too much egg whites in there though, or too many eggs. I know it's going to add more protein, but. I mean, you don't really want your waffles tasting like eggs, because then you would have just made eggs. Just hands off a little bit. Alright guys, so we're all done with all this stuff. Put that off to the side. Alright, your, uh, your next step here. You need the spray stuff. Back that way. Boom, there we go. So, all we need to do here is give this stuff a little shake. I got some zero calorie non stick spray. Give it a little spray. We got the two sided waffle makers, so you gotta make sure you gotta flip it. Take the other side too. That's very important. You don't want your waffle sticking in there. Lock it, and turn it, and turn it on. And while that's heating up, you just get your favorite spoon. Got some mixers in the corner there, but those are for nerds. And 
then really based on the consistency that you get. If you add, I like to add more of the PB2 if it's not thick enough. But it looks like we guesstimated it perfectly here today. I like my batter a little bit thicker. That looks, that looks pretty perfect if you ask me. It's a perfect batter here, look at that. It's definitely going to be peanut buttery. We've definitely put about four to five servings of that. PB2 has two grams of carbs, two grams of protein, zero grams of fat, I believe. Who needs technology? A little forearm pump from that. You guys know what that means. We're beeping. That means it's waffle time. Just gotta dump some of that shit in there. And I've, I've made the mistake before of overfilling it. It's not worth the mess. So we're gonna just be safe here and take the safe route. So all we do is we lock it, we turn it, we pop it, and we lift it. That side's ready to go too. I'm gonna dump that shit in there. Boom. And you just want to get your drippings to minimize that mess. That shit's looking pretty solid. All we do is we lock it, pop it, and then we wait. And then all we gotta do is wait for it. This is how fast it happens, guys. That was about 20 seconds. Shit's about ready to explode. What? It's like, how did I learn to cook so good, you know? That shit was easy. All you do is just get a fork, because we non-sticked it like a pro. Just flop that flopper up there. Got yourself a waffle there, folks. That. That's perfect. But watch out, guys. Be careful. Only pros do two waffles at once. Got another one waiting right here. Look at that. Those are, I mean, those are perfect. Picture perfect. And now all you do, I like to spray it down between between sets here. It's just, uh, like I said. I really don't want to clean up a mess, and I don't think you do either, so just spray that shit down. You gotta spray it down so you can lay it down. Just turn it, boom, pop it. I'm telling you, don't forget the spray. We got about enough batter for one more waffle. Maybe one and a half. Uh-oh, uh-oh, don't want to overfill it. That could be a fatal error right there. Uh-oh, boys and girls. Fork is super hot. I mean, these are—they're perfect. It's literally I mean, they're perfect waffles. All right, we got just enough for one. We gotta do it quick, or the other one's gonna burn.
perfect. It might be the best one yet. Look at that one. Look at that waffle. Eggo couldn't have done it better themselves. And their shit's just made of sugar. And then we just use the leftover batter to make a sad waffle. Just throw that on there. And you guys know how that goes.